On December 10th and 11th, the UN member states will vote on a global pact with a double objective, to sensitize governments to treat migrants with dignity and to protect them. The Holy See has actively collaborated in the drafting of this document. Fabio Baggio explains that the contributions are based on the four key words that the Pope suggests to governments to face the migration crisis. He mentioned them to the ambassadors during their traditional meeting at the beginning of the year. Accogliere, proteggere, promuovere e integrare. It is interesting to note how these verbs are also considered in global documents. We also stress the need for bi-directional integration. It is not only migrants who must make the effort to adapt to local customs. The effort must be shared and there is usually a midpoint where, together, a new society is redefined with the elements that have come from outside. The Vatican also asked for advice from dioceses after facing the migration crisis on a daily basis. After the consultation, they sent a document containing 20 points to the UN, in which the following was underlined. The rights of migrants aren't dependent on whether the migrants are legal or not. Fundamental rights are not annulled for administrative reasons. We asked all bishop conferences to disseminate our document in parishes as well, because there are many Catholics working in sectors related to migration. Although the document won't be binding, it hasn't been supported by everyone. Certain governments, such as those of the United States, Austria or Hungary, have refused to sign it.